Hi, this is Gilly Goldfarb and welcome to my health coaching videos. Five times a week, I talk about a quote that can help you move your life to a better, healthier and happier place. And I hope you gain a lot of value from these videos. Today, the quote of the day is, your body hears everything that your mind says. Now, this quote is by Naomi Judd and is so, so true. Whatever comes out of your mouth influences your subconscious mind and you are acting from your subconscious mind 90% of the day, 90% of the time. So whatever your mind is thinking and your mouth is saying, your body is in effect hearing and your subconscious mind is making it into your reality. Uh, how is this? It is making it into your reality through the thoughts, behaviors, and actions that you are taking. Whether you are saying that you are fit or that you are lazy or that you don't feel good or that you are too tired or that you can't do this or that, your subconscious mind hears it and makes it part of your physical body and your physical reality. All disease is influenced by your mind as well. So whether you are looking in the mirror and thinking, oh, how terrible I look or how fat I am or how sick I look or even how beautiful I am, your subconscious mind hears it and it creates it, uh, it creates it, it helps it become your reality through your choices, your actions, your behaviors and the words that you put out. Now the first step towards changing any, any physical condition is by mastering your mind. You need to control your mind like you control your car with two hands on the wheel. Otherwise, you will fail to achieve your desires. Um, you must, it is like you putting into your car, you want to get to a certain location. If you don't know where that location is, you can't even put it into the GPS to get you to that location. So if you want to get anywhere, you have to know where you're going first of all, and then you have to Take all of the measures to get yourself there. And these are the thoughts and the actions and the words that you put out. You must be in control of your mind and not let it talk. Your mind is actually talking uh, things into you. So we have all of these things going on in our, in our mind, talking to us, telling us, you can do this, you can't do that. And it is actually talking to us. But what it is saying is not necessarily real. And you have to learn to either gain from what it's saying and listen and say, okay, now today this is not right. This I don't have to listen to because this is ridiculous. So we have to be masters over our mind instead of our mind being masters over us. We are not our mind, nor are we our body. We are separate from both of the mind and the body. And uh, this is why you can control them externally. You need to watch your chosen thoughts and make sure they're aligned with where you would like to see yourself. I remember that once I started observing my thoughts, I noticed that most of them were so negative. I couldn't believe it. I, I was just really thinking negative thoughts throughout most of the day. <laughs> it was my, my life was in a very bad position at the time. I was I had no money and I was raising my two daughters with the you know, mental disability, and uh, th my life was in a very bad place. And then when I started to look into my thoughts, I noticed how negative they were. And uh, I found out that I was unconscious most of the time, behaving from my negative thought patterns without even noticing that I was doing this. And most of, our, most, most of us are just like this. We behave from built-in thought patterns that, received, that we received from our ancestors through genetics and through the environment that we grew up in. But if you prefer not to live the life of your parents and not to suffer from the same diseases or faulty habits or behaviors that lead their life, then you have the ability to make the change. You have the ability to change your life and to live it as you wish and desire it would be. But the only thing you have to do is to first of all start to master your mind that also masters your body. So by mastering your body and your mind, you will be able to lead the life that you truly desire. So at the time when I began noticing my negative thought patterns, every negative thought pattern that entered my mind, I decided to cancel it out. 
So I would say cancel, cancel, cancel to that negative, very um, lowering, in a, it would lower me down, it would bring me down these thoughts. And I just said cancel, cancel, cancel to these thoughts. And afterwards, since I understood and I learned that we have only a place for one thought at a time in our minds, then I would decide to replace that negative thought with what I wanted to have instead, with a positive thought. Instead of seeing what I had in front of me, which in effect was the product of my negative thought patterns in the past, I started to use my mind to create what I preferred to have in my life instead. And this is how I started the path of controlling my thoughts and my mind and also my life. And my life changed completely from where it was at that time. And you're, you could do the same thing. Your, your life is precious. You don't want to waste your time thinking thoughts and maintaining habits that do not get you to where you wish to be in this lifetime. And you don't want to keep that negative state. You must get your act together and start controlling your thoughts about yourself and how you see things in life because this is the starting point to everything that you want to have in your life. Negative thoughts have the power to change your physiology and to create disease within your body. It is never really enough to treat the condition without helping the person understand or change their thoughts that brought them to this condition in the first place. So this is really where you have to begin. You have to notice your negative thought patterns. Notice when they are coming up and instead of just going in with them and crying and and spending your time in these negative thought patterns that you, you don't have to have them rule your life you just switch it make the switch into a positive thought of where you want to be instead of where you are right now instead of seeing what's in front of you seeing the state you're in because this was created through your negative thought patterns in the past so to make the change, you have to change those negative thought patterns and replace them with what you do want in your life. Replace them with a positive thought um, instead that will point you to where you want to be. So the question you want to ask yourself today is uh, what thoughts does your mind entertain most hours of the day? And if they are negative, ask yourself if you are willing to work on replacing them immediately as they come. So this is the question of the day. Think about this. If you are not in the place you desire to be with your body, with your health, with your life, with any field of your life today, then you do have negative thought patterns. And what you are creating through the thoughts you are choosing to entertain in your mind is what you will have tomorrow in your life. So you can change these thoughts to reflect what you do want to have in your life and this is what you should do now and I know it is time consuming you won't believe how much time I spent on <laughs> changing my thought patterns but it really was worth it okay so now let's move on to the affirmation of the day that you want to tell yourself the affirmation is my mind is positive and my, and healthy and so is my body my mind is positive and healthy and so is my body. Now tell this to yourself as many times as you remember to do so today because with repetition, the affirmation has the power to alter your brain so that you think and behave differently, which will lead you to have a different life from what you have today, one that you will be happier with. So thank you very much for joining me here today. I hope you liked this video. If you did, write in the contents what you liked about the video. Give it a thumbs up. And um, also visit my website at the, the gorilla diet.com where you have lots of uh, programs and um, books to help you change to and start living the life that you desire to live. So thank you very much for joining me.